Hi there, I am Potato Zuli, and today on my server, I am going to build a house. Uh, so far, I've just been living in the Ricka Flecker Inn, and uh, the room in there is pretty small, and I've been running out of chest space. Uh, so, I need like a bigger place to live, and a nicer place. And somewhere to store my stuff and everything. I'm probably going to make a base somewhere outside of spawn someday uh... but for right now i'm just gonna have a house in the spawn town so uh... this house it's got three floors to it there's um... the first floor which the walls are made of stone brick on uh... the second floor the walls are spruce planks and the third floor is actually like the roof area but um... it is a pretty big roof it's like pretty tall. I use a pretty, I used a, um, a pretty steep slant, so the area in the roof place is bigger. So I'm gonna have, like, a, some rooms or something up there. So I ended up running out of uh, dark oak logs for the uh, side areas, so I needed to go cut down a few trees here in the dark oak forest, it's pretty close to spawn. Uh, with this house, I'm actually trying something new that I haven't done before. Um, I am like placing the logs like one out from the walls. It gives it more depth, kind of, and also uh, it'll give it a little bit more window space. I've never really done this before. I'm kind of trying something new. It's I think it's going to turn out well though. So now I'm starting on the second floor, which I'm using the spruce planks for. I I don't I didn't make ladders for some reason to get up here, so I had to like keep destroying blocks and pillaring up. Um in this episode I'm actually not going to like finish the windows and stuff. I'm just going to do the outside based stuff. In the next episode, I'm going to come and, like, uh, finish it up, the windows in, make the rooms, the inside, uh, and I'm going to put some cracked and mossy stone bricks in the stone brick area at the bottom, just to give it a bit more detail to make it more old. I am kind of going for a slightly medieval theme with this. Um... I also change out the door to one of the new spruce doors. It looks kind of like old and stuff. Pretty cool. So now I have uh, finished up the spruce plank layer and I'm starting on the roof. But something I realized is that uh, one of the roof sections doesn't actually go up to a full peak. Uh, it, it goes up to like a double peak because the whole uh, area on that side is even, which I need it to be odd. So I had to go and take down that whole wall there, that, which I'm taking down right now, and I had to move it one block to the side. It took quite a while. It was pretty bad. A pretty big mistake on my part. It It is raining here. It's pretty smelly rain stuff. So now I'm like finish I'm putting the stone bricks back where they're supposed to be and putting the logs in. Placing the logs over there and stuff. There's uh MC Little Al who's just run by there. Um I ha what I'm using to record this, uh it, I'm actually using like a camera account. Uh, it's a guy in creative mode and he's just floating around. Uh, and I'm using the, I'm, I'm recording it with him. So, uh, now I've fixed up that wall and I've put the peak part in. And now I'm getting some oak planks and I'm going to start on the roof section. And I f fell off. Uh, roofs, are, for me, they're always pretty hard to make because, um, 
the stairs and stuff can be pretty hard to work with sometimes and it's pretty easy to fall off a roof what I'm doing with this roof is um, I'm, I'm using stairs and full oak plank blocks to give it a steeper slope and then I'll have more room on the inside for stuff I'm probably gonna have like a storage area in the attic something really cool about this roof is uh, it's built with blocks in a way where um, um, nothing can spawn on it because the only blocks that are like showing are the uh, stairs and on the very top peak part I'm going to use slabs and mobs cannot spawn on those and it's pretty cool so I don't have to have any weird light stuff on the top of my house So uh, now I've switched the camera view to the back area of the roof, and um, I'm filling in those little peak areas with some spruce f to just give it some back thing. I'm using some of the dark oak fences for little kind of window things in the side, and uh, now I'm going to start on the back roof area. And the and the back side of the house, the roof, I ended up not really liking it. It's like too big and flat, just a big plane of oak. So in the next episode, I'm probably going to come back and um, uh, put something on it. I'm I kind of wanted to put like a balcony or something, uh, just to give it something to have on the back side there. And also a balcony would be pretty cool to have. So on the server I've been doing a lot of stuff. Uh, like in between episodes I have been uh, trading with villagers and stuff. And uh, we have like a villager breeder thing. And we get a lot of good librarians, and they sell, like, enchanted books, uh, and they they sell, like, Fortune, Silk Touch, Looting 3, it's really awesome. So, I've been getting a lot of emeralds and trading with them a lot to get some good stuff. So, now I'm almost finished with the roof, and now I've just switched to this area because there's a few, uh, blocks that are missing just to connect it all make it look nice put a few slabs and stairs I really like how the roof looks I think I did pretty well on building it so now I'm done with the roof and I'm just gonna pan around the house here just looking at it so in the next episode we're gonna come back add some new, new details and do the interior, put some stone bricks and mossy bricks on the outside. Goodbye. Have a nice day.